In Game 7, it's not just about basketball. It's about who can weather the storm and emerge victorious amidst the chaos of injuries and strategic chess matches. After a disheartening loss in Game 5, the Pacers regrouped and clawed their way back into contention, setting the stage for a decisive Game 7 showdown against the Knicks. Their 116-103 victory in Game 6 pushed the Knicks to the edge of elimination. Pascal Siakam emerged as a key player for Indiana, delivering a stellar performance with 25 points on 11 of 21 shooting, along with 7 rebounds, 5 assists, and 2 steals. Andrew Nembhard contributed 15 points, including a solid 3 of 4 from beyond the arc. Nearly all of Indiana's starting lineup scored in double figures, propelling them to a 49 of 91 shooting performance from the field and dominance in the rebounding department with a 47-35 advantage. Meanwhile, Jalen Brunson led the Knicks with 31 points, showcasing his resilience amidst a team grappling with injuries. Missing key players like Mitchell Robinson, Bojan Bogdanovic, Julius Randle, and once again, OG Ananobi, the Knicks faced additional concern with Josh Hart exiting the game due to an abdominal injury. Hart's absence, especially in a critical Game 7 and potentially beyond, could pose significant challenges for New York. Looking ahead to Game 7 at Madison Square Garden, questions loom over Josh Hart's availability and impact on the Knicks lineup. His potential absence adds to the Knicks' injury woes, testing their depth and resilience. On the other side, Pascal Siakam's prowess in exploiting mismatches presents a strategic dilemma for the Knicks, who struggle to contain him without their ideal defenders. The Pacers' defensive adjustments against Jalen Brunson in Game 6 showed promise, disrupting his offensive rhythm and limiting his effectiveness. Whether these adjustments hold up in Game 7 remains to be seen as both teams strategize and adapt to the evolving dynamics of the series. With Brunson's ability to adjust and the Pacers' defensive strategies in play, Game 7 promises to be a compelling battle to determine the series' outcome. Following a humbling defeat in Game 5, the Pacers regathered their composure and surged back into contention, setting the stage for a winner-takes-all Game 7 showdown against the Knicks. Their resounding 116-103 triumph in Game 6 not only kept their postseason hopes alive, Live, but also pushed the Knicks to the brink of elimination. Pascal Siakam emerged as a pivotal figure for Indiana, delivering a standout performance with 25 points on 11 of 21 shooting, complemented by 7 rebounds, 5 assists, and 2 steals. Andrew Nembhard added 15 points, including a stellar 3 of 4 from downtown. With nearly every starter reaching double-digit scoring figures, the Pacers showcased their offensive depth, shooting 49 of 91 from the field and dominating the boards with a commanding 47-35 rebounding advantage. Meanwhile, despite Jalen Brunson's valiant 31 point effort for the Knicks, the team continued to grapple with a string of injuries. Absences of key players like Mitchell Robinson, Boyan Bogdanovich, Julius Randle, and the recurring absence of OG Anunobi stretched their roster thin. Josh Hart's departure due to an abdominal injury further compounded the Knicks' challenges, casting doubt on his availability for the critical Game 7 and potentially beyond. Looking ahead to the pivotal Game 7 clash at Madison Square Garden, uncertainty surrounds Josh Hart's status and its potential ramifications for the Knicks' lineup. His potential absence intensifies the pressure on New York York's remaining players, testing their resilience amidst adversity. On the opposing end, Pascal Siakam's ability to exploit mismatches presents a strategic dilemma for the Knicks, who lack ideal defenders to contain him effectively. The Pacers' defensive adjustments against Jalen Brunson in Game 6 provided a glimmer of hope, disrupting his offensive rhythm and limiting his impact on the game. However, the true test lies in whether these adjustments can withstand the Knicks' countermeasures in Game 7. With Brunson's adaptability and the Pacers' defensive strategies at play, Game 7 promises to be a captivating battle, where every Every possession counts in determining the series' outcome.